It better be all do a Z dance. Harry butthole. Dude, I have a hairy ass. Like, literally, I feel bad for any girl that ever decides she's going to like decide she's going to eat some guy's ass today, and it ends up being mine because she is going to have the worst time. Yeah, I remember one time in high school, like, I saw my friend's asshole because I guess he, I guess someone passed him and looked like a fucking rat or like a fucking rat killer died in his asshole. That's how hairy it was. Why did you see your friend's asshole? Dude, you got fucking problems, bro. No, because some, <laughs> someone pants them. <laughs> Weird. So you yeah. saw his asshole? Yeah, That's yeah, because why would you look at his asshole? What? Did you take a pencil and, like, no. spray nope. the fucking nope. hair around and shit, see if there's anything in there? Yeah, thank Dude, you. I, thank you, later, guys. Later, later you. I have a story <laughs> about me <laughs> pantsing this kid, and his dick came guy, out in high school, and I ruined ass. his high school reputation because he had a baby dick. So Dude, I'm gonna explain that story later, okay? I've already explained it so many times yesterday. So we all have- so we all have panting stories? Yeah, I well, Maybe. I was the one that pants the kid though, because back in I've middle seen, school, I'll I mean, fucking explain it now. Back in middle school, I've all of us we used to just pants, pants each other. It was like a like thing. They, like we we didn't get, get mad about it or anything. It was just hella funny. Need, uh, and um, one day this kid Gerald, he was wearing so sweats like and he was standing in front of that three or four ass. girls. So um, I, oh. me and my friends thought it would have been hella funny, and my friend Richard was like, "Hey, this is like the perfect time. Go fucking pants him." And uh, because I had to get him back because he did, he got me yesterday the day well, the day before, and I went up behind him, did it, and like I grabbed it from his ankles, and he wasn't fucking wearing underwear, and I um I like ran away. I didn't know that he it came out because I saw like he was white, and I saw it out of the corner of my eye, but like I wasn't paying attention. And all I hear is the girl screaming, it's so tiny, and I was like, what? What the fuck just happened? I look over there, and his fucking sweats are down by his ankles, and his tiny ass dick is out, and he's like running at me like he's about to punch me. It was the funniest was this, thing. Was this back in high school or something? It was my freshman year. Nice. The question is, did he pull up his pants, or did he punch you? Well, yes, he pulled up his pants. He didn't end up punching me because he's a fucking nerd. I wish he would have, because I felt so bad. I ruined his whole high school reputation. He never got any pussy his whole sky like all four years. And uh, all them like they literally, I had to leave that school because I kept I kept getting in too many fights. But uh, I heard that he like still fucking hates me Shit, to this man, day. Mom. Like every time I talk to my friends from that school, they like say that oh. he still talks about me and says that he like wants to beat my ass. Dude, have you seen Central Intelligence? Yeah, you hella just... That's straight up your fucking story. Well, minus the panting, but more like the throwing in the middle of the auditorium. That shit the beginning, when the fucking... That fat motherfucker is taking a shower, butt fucking naked, scrubbing the Yeah, except he's a little scrawny fag, and like... Has yet to, um... Fight anybody. I think you guys just have a little genius, bro. You guys got fucking issues. And I don't like you, motherfucker. Do you wanna fuck my arsehole? It doesn't have to be an arsehole. <laughs>